Welcome back. I think LGD definitely has the potential to run them over, but yeah, I think they are definitely on a timer. Zeal though, as we know, Beastmaster nowadays, even if you have a tough lane, which it looks like he actually might die here, Tombstone's down. And there's a, a little small TP from Monet, I like it. Should be able to get him. Nicely done. It's gonna let him be pretty aggressive in the early game. Yeah, smart. It's gonna be big damage. I mean, um, might actually get XWY. I mean, absolutely, with the, the two of them coming over. Here to try and help, nothing to say, going for the kill. Another good angle with the timber chain, and, and that'll do it. They take out XWY. Big focus from PSG LGD onto that mid lane very early here. It's gonna be level six soon, too. Uh, he does have to be careful, though, Boca. Might actually be able to get a solo kill here. Nothing to say. No way. He actually Easy. gets him. <laughs> Boca. He doesn't even laugh or anything. He's stone cold today. Yeah. Zeal. There's another decay in four seconds. Hey, he's looking dead. Give it a Monet. Nice. Still, it's very much more evident oh. in, the, in, the, in the XP department. What we've got Zeal Tons moment. of rotations. I'm trying to get in under the tower here, Siamese Cat. Even while you smile and nothing to say, show up top to kill the tombstone and help out Zeal. And they might be able to get Monet here also. Looks like it. Uh, he's trying to at least bring down Planet with him, but he won't manage to do so. Is Big rotations. Yeah, I mean, after... Boboka ran and did like this crazy sprint through to watch Ancients and also to put one in case of like farming. While on the other side too, we did see PSG LGD also having super aggressive wards. Boboka. Oh, big oh, damage oh, there oh. for nothing it says. He comes crashing between the two of them. The I Invis. mean, <laughs> is oh, oh, they got the sentry. Oh, but can they Buddy? finish him? Oh, yep, yeah. they've got the glimpse. Boboka goes down. XWY still has a remnant to play with. He looking dead though. That's uh, indeed with a thunder strike upon him. Flame Guard will protect him from some of the damage. Maybe he's okay. I mean, he's gonna is, he's gonna get probably chased. His mana's Is there any other way too. out of here for, for XWI? He's caught in the field. There, there's no escape. Oh, the dodges the slight, dodges with the slight fist, but uh, yeah, still goes down. This is big though. The fact that Zeo was able to get this Dominator, now they can apply pressure top it. Uh oh, Pichu. He's looking pretty dead. TP is back up, but it doesn't matter. Yeah, with him going down, unlikely Aster's going to send anyone else up here. See over towards the mid. Aster, I'll get the catch on to why you smile. And they'll start to be able to put some pressure onto the tier one mid themselves. It's a risky build, but it's an so aggressive. far so good. It's an incredibly aggressive build. As Monet. These are mat these are really, really massive kills that they're able to set up. I mean, can here. Aster punish this? The smoke's coming, but it's scanned instantly. Nothing to say, he's gonna be the body. Oh, he's gonna walk into this. There's a finger. And they will blow him up. And see if they can get anything more from this one, Aster. They jump forward looking for Planet. Oh, it's gonna be the glimpse back, and Zeal, he'll drop the roar. Movement speed buff to get out of there. And also be able to claim the kill against Pichu. And now nothing to say. Yeah, that's pretty, yeah, you, you don't normally see doom. that, especially when the, the timing was as quick as it was from XXS. Oh, this Doom is super dead. Yeah, Shiro just, keeping full control of this bottom lane. LGD. They're going to start to build that lead that they, they want to play with. Absolutely. And Monet also, Ooh, he walks look, into look a timber. Look at this damage. It's immediately half his HP pool gone. He's gone. He's, he's dead. Oh my, Jesus. How many trees was that? He only cut like four of them too at the Whirling Death. He knows something's up. Mini glimpse. Just enough vision though. It's a bit Still deep. close to the tower. They want to go for it though. And of course, with nothing to say there, they oh, take oh, the kill oh, oh, oh. so quickly. That there is no chance for Asta to respond. Only just 15 minutes or so in. Asta heading out with the smoke. Maboka. He's going to go for the jump on, onto the Marcy, onto why you smile. This is risky. Won't quite get him dragged back into the static storm, but it doesn't matter. Just brought over into the claws of the bear. Oh, and this game is this game is starting to get completely out of control. Asta look, don't have the heroes to stop them. And even look at this, they have a defensive ward placed up because they know that Monet's starting to feel desperate. This is just a dead nature's profit. Yeah, no, no escape from this. See you later. And he knows, stands there, pokes back at them a little bit, but nothing else to be done. No way. They know he's in it. Oh, no way. They found him. It really feels like there's no <laughs> safe part of the map right now for Asta. See you later. And Monet, I mean, he comes back. It's the same He's ward. under the same ward. They're just going to run right at him with the Marcy Disruptor. I mean, will he get out in time? Do you think he'll sort of read the situation? Uh, he's got a TP pretty soon. Oh, they actually found Shiro in the meantime. Whoopsie. They know he's in it. And they do have Static Storm. 
they feel it's necessary. Planet. He gets him. He does go down. He does the Maelstrom proc. <laughs> but uh, Monet in return will fall. Yeah, I mean, because it, because he was right. The lane was right. He was getting like 30 creeps denied against him in lane. Really cute play there from Zeo. Backpacking his helmet, the Overlord, constantly so that he can set up onto that. I mean, let's watch this. Oh, Bear is frenzied with Max Sidekick. And there's no Glyph. I mean, the, the speed that the damage is being done here. Uh, so they're, they're trying to jump in off a Voka, and they'll get him. They like, oh. will be able to get why you smile in return. But it's a Rax. Oh, fortifications there in time. But uh, yeah, this bear doesn't really want to go anywhere. Shiro wants to stick around, take the objective. 19 minutes in, the melee Rax in the mid lane, gone. They can just start poking at the base again. Here comes the frenzy, here comes the sidekick. Look at this tower disappear. I mean, you know, Pichu's here, but he's like, anybody else want to help? Nope, because another Rax is just dead. This game's, this game's over. It really feels like there's no comeback. They yep, called it. They call it. I mean, they know. It really is. It really is over. GG is called. PSG LGD, 21 minutes in. They completely crushed them. That was... That was a statement, honestly. There, we got an offlane Rubik. Is he going to go Meteor Hammer? Because I've seen this in some pubs. I've seen people doing it a bit here. And he got full. He got tipped look, uh, right at the start okay. of the game. Nothing to say. Getting aggressive, wanting to deny some of this farm. Ooh, oh, they and might now maybe be able to go for Pichu Omni. instead. Yeah, yeah, they've got the three of them. Uh, they'll be able to take him out. I mean, mid, the Boca, he's got to be careful. He is you know, pretty squishy. Only level three, of course, at this stage. Nothing to say. He's going to want to dive in for this one. Next slide. He's got him. He's going to get the kill, and he's going to be out of there in time. Not a chance for any sort of grab to, to catch him. 12 minute power in. It is the DD. Oh, and it's a nothing big to one. say he's going to be able to grab that. Doesn't want to fight with it for now, though. Let Planet fall here in the mid. And uh, in return, down bottom, Zeal with the so pressure low. putting onto the tower. He's able to get beyond it and take down Pichu. Uh, look at bottom lane. They are really good from going for Zeal again. And they, uh, they'll use the lasso here to make sure. Oh, um, but the familiar stuns are coming out. He'll still go down. Not quite able to play his way out of that one, Zeal. It's complete uninterrupted free farm on the top half of the map. And bottom. And we'll be able to get in under the tower here as they'll look to dive forward for planet. I get good familiar stuns. But uh, not <laughs> enough to save him. Mid tower though, at the same time, LGD, they'll get the they'll get the bigger one. Maybe the deny. Oh, I can't. He's been caught by the root. And in fact, Pichu, he has the heals. But, uh, damage over time ends up ticking him out. And now another steal of the stacks. I mean, this time it's Baboka. I think he might. Let's see if he pays with his life, though. Planet, he's in the area. Nice charge. All right. <laughs> John to XXS with the chains combo. He's tanky, too, and he has the Greaves at the moment locked. Monet. He's running into this fight. They'll get the pulverize off on a planet. Now XWY, he's ready to head in and see if he can get on top of another. As why you smile, also to fall. Asta doing a good job at turning up to these fights. Shiro. Can they set up onto for him? him? He's got a bit too much HP to work through, Shiro. He's going to be fine. He's got Heavenly Grace too. He's tanky. See Monet. Go for Planet instead. Monet. Heels are there for the Sun Ray, but uh, not enough to save him. Planet goes down. Well, he's going to look towards Shiro, but the Zeal's turned up as well with the backup. Guardian Angel. It's going to be popped as Aston. They continue to push on. Zeal, he's been caught out of the side. They'll take out the Visage. Double kill for Monet. Aster, just the numbers every single time. It's like four or five of them when you look at the map. <laughs> I haven't heard of that one. Now uh, Zeal again. I mean, Monet, he's, he's just ready to go, go, go now. In under the tower, more stacks for him. They are really ramping up the pressure. They're kind of just challenging PSG LGD. They're like telling them, come at us. Monet. He's going to try and get in on this. He wants to just, keep he's going. Just in. Dive in the tier two here. Not a care in the world as he goes for Zeal. Backup's coming in though. Now he'll start to care a little bit more as he pounces away. He leaves Pichu to go down. Got to be careful how aggressive you are. Shiro now, Aghanims is finished. Level two morph. He's ready to join his team and fight constantly. Monet oh, just jumps in. He's gone back in. That's a little reckless. All right. I mean... 
They've got the numbers here, PSG OG. They'll turn and fight back, but Boca's gone. And uh, I feel like he got baited in a little bit there by Monet. <laughs> Next success. They get the stun. He might also be in trouble. They dive in the tower, and with the waveform fourth, they indeed oh. have enough damage. Uh, it's a couple of kills there off the back of what was uh, Aster's decision to fight. Looking to be a little more greedy. And Aster, they're looking to go oh, in. Oh, let's see what XWY is able to get. He's going for Zeal. Oh, oh the, the stun there coming in to put a stop to the pulverize. I mean, Zeal's still alive. And now, now PSG, OG, they can get back in on the Shiro. Jumps it towards the back lines, not quite able to immediately burst out for Boca. It's the save comes in with the Guardian Angel. See if they can continue to chase them out. Chains are there. XWY has to put the BKB. Trying to chase forward here again. And Monet. Monet's turned up. So we get the first bounce off onto the Morphling. Starting to steal those stats. But now Morphling. he gets stolen back. I mean, Shira's ready to turn here. Jumps in himself with the pounce, gets the connection onto the Slark. Monet's in trouble, he's gone! Uh -oh. And Shiro just a bit too much for the Slark to bite right now, as Shiro using the Slark's potential against himself. And now with the stun putting a stop to XXS's TP, they are going to be able to claim a fourth kill from this fight. Oh no, and now their draft is definitely going to start feeling that pressure. With PSG LGD looking to strike Monet. They're going to jump him. He gets morphed. Shiro's in. Yeah, Shiro's chasing. Couple of bounces. He closes the gap in onto Siamese Cat. It is just such a good morph game. And oh, look, right next to Roche. Do they want to go for it? They want more kills. Well, they, yeah, they got the setup here with the chains. And Planet, he's here with the follow up. Now it's Roche time. XXS tried to find a solution. He's going for Hex next on the yep. Rubik. So, see if that's going to be able to even get. Got the toss back on to Maboka. Monet here to try and help out. The Sunray's Sunray. coming in from Why You Smile. Maboka goes down and Monet. He's got to run. Pops the depth shroud and has to, to back off. What are you going to do and here at, if you're at planet. Step? Look at his positioning right now. And there he is. He's in with the jump. They get the toss back on to XXS. The Guardian Angel comes out. They'll get the pulverized control onto the Ember. They've taken down nothing to say, but the Supernova's successful. Asta. Got to try and reset themselves here. XXS gets picked off at the side by a Soul Assumption. Shiro, he's still good to go. The push with the Familiars onto the barracks. Baboka tries to get in on this, but immediately just gets clipped by the stun, and Zeal takes him out as well with the Soul Assumption. Monet is looking for Shiro, but Zeal's cleaned it up. It's a triple kill for Zeal. Four dead on Aster. They'll they call, call it. it. GG as PSGL GD. They take this game to, again, it's another quick one, 26 minutes, uh, but in, definitely in a bit of a different fashion from the, the kind of just straight one-sided matchup in game one.